Answering the phone. I want you in a monster movie. You get it, Tracy. <laughs> and hurry, you big ape, or I'll answer it myself. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Anyone there? This is Prince Otis. Prince Otis? Hey, I read about him. Tomorrow the prince is going to be crowned king of Petronia. Your Royal Majesty, this is Jake Kong. At your service, Your Highnessy. I need your help. For the past ten years, the Petronium Royal Crown has been kept hidden in England's Tower of London. Now that I'm going to become king, the crown is to be returned to my country. But I'm worried that it'll be stolen by ghosts. Ghosts? What makes you think that? The Royal Secret Service overheard a radio transmission from Prime Evil. Prime evil? Wow! There's no time to waste! We're on our way to England, Your Excellency. Oh, thanks, jolly good. Duke Fenwick will be waiting for you at the Tower of London. Hey, guys, what do you say we go in uniform? Why not? Well, what are we waiting for? Let's go! Go! Absorbers. Why don't you guys go on a diet? <laughs> Sorry about that, GB. Into flight mode. <laughs> After you two steal the crown, take it to Petronia. According to their royal law, whoever possesses the crown must be made their king. When you're king, you'll claim it all for me. Sounds positively smashing. I say, we're on our way. Cheerio. Cheerio! Ah, England. Nothing makes me feel better than a change of scenery. It's very nice of you to show us around, Duke Fenwick. It's an old suit of armor, Tracy. <sighs> You've got nothing to worry about, Duke Fenwick. We'll protect the prince's crown. It isn't only the crown. I'm worried that the royal jewels might be stolen, too. Why's that? The reason the prince sent me to England was to sell his jewels. You see, our kingdom is very poor. This is the famous Star Diamond, the prince's most prized possession. But he wants to sell it, to buy food and clothing for our people. How about that? Prince Otis must be an okay guy. Duke, you have nothing to worry about. We Ghostbusters haven't failed yet. Thank you. I feel better. Now, where's the crown and the rest of the jewels? They're being guarded at the top floor of the tower, up those stairs. Then let's get going. The tower's five stories tall? Oh. Next time we take a job, make sure it includes elevators. A 
and put this bright one with the others. <laughs> Guess. Hunter, show them how rude we are. My displeasure. Let me out of here! What's going on here? Oh. <laughs> Don't they look like a couple of fussy caterpillars? <laughs> well, my bubbleizer will get them out of here. <laughs> Steal the crown. And... Where is it? There is what? The Star Diamond! Oh, it's gone! What happened to it? Don't know. And don't jolly care. All I want is my crown. I say, a perfect fit, Sinjur. Now on to Petronia, where I shall become king. We're not going anywhere until I find my diamond. Only one more flight. Let go. Looks like double bubble trouble. Oh, look. That animal's wearing my diamond. Hand it over. Do what she says. If you know what's good for you. Run, Tracy. We'll stop him. <laughs> You're not going anywhere. Oh. <laughs> Is that so? Hey, wait a minute. Hey, come on, no fair. fair. Oh, you expect us to be fair. <laughs> I'll teach that ape to make a monkey out of me. This is the only way he could have gone. I see. Look at that. Who does he think he's fooling? Not me. In fact, darling, I'd say he's in a rather ticklish situation. <laughs> now, for the finishing touch. <laughs> the Star Diamond. Oh, at last. It's mine. Good. Now, let's go to Petronia. So I can become king. <laughs> Cheerio! So that's Primeval's plan. To make Haunter king. We've got to stop that. <laughs> Try to hit the point of that lance. Whoa! Quick, to the ghost buggy! Hurry! Oh, terrific! We're completely lost! We'll never catch up with Haunter and Mysteria! It doesn't make sense! According to my map, we should be nearly... Nah, now I know what's wrong! The map's upside down! Hey, everything you guys do is upside down! Let's see... Uh-oh! Here's a place called Haunted Mountain! You wouldn't consider turning around, would you? No, Eddie. Just read the map. Make a right turn through that mountain pass. Yeah, now I know where we're headed. So do I. Headed for trouble. There's Haunted Mountain. Creepy looking, huh? Petronia's on the other side. Haunter and Mysteria have got to be around. Hey, look. There they are. Got GB snow outfit, Tracy? Uh-huh. Oh, now 
now they expect mm, me to ski. Well, I always knew the Ghostbusters were going downhill. Let's get them. You know, darling, I was thinking, since we have the crown, why should we give Petronius gold to prime evil? You don't mean... Oh, yes, I do. Hmm, a splendid idea, Mysteria. You'll be king, and I, darling, can be queen. And we'll keep all the gold for ourselves. What did you say? <laughs> just a little joke. <laughs> then how about just a little bolt? Well, here come those ghost bunglers. Those blimeys are catching up. We've got to lose them. Take the shortcut through Haunted Mountain. Oh, but they'll just follow us. Let them. In fact, I hope they do. The mountain spirit lives on Haunted Mountain. I'll see to it that it takes care of the ghost busters once and for all. <laughs> Where'd they go? Maybe they went into that canyon. <laughs> Switch on GB Super Duper Scooper. Okay, okay. Get going, GB. Dig an escape tunnel. Work, work, work. That's all I do. It's getting closer. Hurry, hurry, faster. <laughs> we did a pretty good disappearing act. Yep, but if we're going to catch Mysteria and Haunter, we'd better start digging up. Go! I think I froze my tailpipe. Everyone on full alert. So keep one eye out for Mysteria and Haunter, and the other eye out for the snow monster. Looks like we've got double trouble. Get a load of the mountain spirit. It's even more awesome. See, we love to see in chat, but we have a train to catch. It's the Orient Express. Oh, how fortunate. Now we can go to Petronia in style. We've got to stop them! If the mountain spirit doesn't stop us first. Look! <laughs> got anything in your ghost pack to help us? <laughs> Is that it? <laughs> All right! Our freeze-o-matic! <laughs> nice work, Tracy. It turned to solid ice. Yeah, it'll take a week for the monster to defrost. Come on. We gotta catch up with Haunter and Mysteria. Oh, this is the only way to travel. Faster! They're getting away! If you want fast, go ride a rocket. <laughs> Those infernal ghostbusters! They're in the passenger car! My ghost-sniffing schnozzle is picking them up. Maybe they're in disguise. Hunter, that beard's a fake. Take it off! Oh, oh damn! Sorry. Make believe that never happened, okay, huh? <laughs> Eddie, you've got to be more careful. Now that woman is obviously mysterious. Watch this. Oh! Sorry. <laughs> Forget it, Tracy. My nose isn't working. It must be out of odor. <laughs> now what'll we do? Tracy and I will check the cars up front. You check the caboose. Right. Ready or not, here I come. I'd say that caboose needs setting loose. Oh, good idea. Goodbye. 
and good riddance. Whoa, what was that? Why do I have a feeling I'm in a heap of trouble? Get out! Yeah. Or better yet, get help! Eddie, hang in there! We'll save you! All right, now what? Okay, Tracy, get GB into choo-choo mode. Choo-choo? You got a cold or something? <laughs> Now we're rid of all three of them from income. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> we're coming! Whoa! Yeah, I'm slowing down. Yeah! Jumped out of that old track! <laughs> He's headed for that broken down bridge! Eddie, stay there! Tracy'll get you! Tracy can't see! Don't fall, Tracy. You might hurt yourself. And me, too. That's it! You're gonna make it! <laughs> All right, Tracy! <laughs> Come on, guys. Mysterion and Hunter have a big head start on us. I bet they've already reached Petronia. Hmm. Petronia's on the other side of that mountain ridge. Maybe we can take a shortcut. Turn on the super duper scooper. Again? I'm too poop -po 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 to scoop. Yes, I have no choice. There it is. My future palace. You mean my palace. I'm going to be queen. Give it back. And I want the star diamond too. How dare it's mine! What's going on? Where are the Ghostbusters? It's mine! I'm here! What's happening? The ground's shaking! It's shaking us! Sorry we're late. We just wanted to congratulate you two. Well, after all, you beat us here, so we want to give you a prize. A prize? What are you talking about? Well, since you like to travel in style, we thought we'd give you a first-class, one-way trip back to Hot Quarters. Good catch, Eddie! I don't know how to thank you. And now, I must see about selling the jewels. No, Prince Otis. You don't have to sell your royal jewels. I don't understand. My people are poor. Very poor. Not anymore. Haunted Mountain is almost solid gold. Your country is rich. Very rich. Gold? Wonderful. Now I can feed and clothe my people. I can build schools and libraries. A and as a reward, I'll buy you all whatever you want. A banana tree. No, Tracy, no bananas. Thank you, Prince, but we don't want any reward. Speak for yourself. I want a color TV, a computer, a lifetime supply of cookies, an amusement park, a ton of ice cream, a pony, an airplane, a swimming pool. No, two swimming pools. <laughs> one hot and one cold. And a boat. A big, big, big boat. In today's story, Hunter and Mysteria were caught just before they stole the royal jewels. Yeah, but I'll bet they didn't learn anything from it. What do you think they should have learned, Belfry? They should have learned that stealing won't get you anywhere. Especially if you get caught. Even if you don't get caught, stealing is wrong. And you'll never feel right about yourself, even if no one finds out about it. Uh, sounds like good advice. Too bad Hunter and Mysteria don't get it. But we know you do. Oh, hum. Primeval's been quiet for a while. 
Huh. Let's see what's happening elsewhere in the universe. What's this? Ah, Durham Castle in Fairy Tale Land. <gasps> and beautiful as always. And oh look, Princess Gwendolyn and Prince Delvin are getting married. Oh, how romantic! And dost thou, Princess Gwendolyn? Take thee, Prince Delwyn, to love and honor. No, she doesn't. <gasps> it's that wicked ghost, Gimgul. Oh, no. Delwyn. Don't worry, dearest. I'll... Delwyn! He's gone! Oh, what have you done with my prince? Gwendolyn, what happened? What did Gimgul do to Prince Delvin? Gwendolyn! This looks like a job for the... Ghostbusters, huh? Ghostbusters, that's what we are. Go over there. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that tickles. Stop laughing. Someone's calling us. <laughs> so what? You guys are a joke anyway. Ghostbusters, Jake speaking. It's Madame Y. Trouble in fairy tale land? Uh, Madam, are you feeling all right? Is there really a fairy tale land? I don't know. Well, I'd like to believe there is. Madam, where is this place? It's just past the end of the rainbow. And hurry! I think you boys are needed there now. Okay, we're on our way. Yeah, these ghost dusters are going ghost busting. Let's go, ghost busters! GB? Cool! Not now! I was dreaming about this terrific looking convertible! Get your mind off cars and switch to flight mode! Quick! Flight mode? Sure, you guys are airheads anyway! Alright, we're in flight! Now which way do I go? Which way? Uh, let me see. Uh, I'm not sure, GB. You're not sure? I'd expect that from Eddie, not you. Look, why don't we just go back home? You can have a nice warm glass of milk, and th then... We can't do that. We're on a mission. Top priority. Now let's hoist anchor and really get moving. Oh, aye, aye, Captain. Which way? Or is that asking too much? Uh, that way. No offense, Eddie, but I think you've gone loco. What are we doing up here anyway? We have to rescue a princess who lives just beyond the rainbow. Beyond the rainbow? You got clouds in your head? Just move it, GB. There must be a rainbow around here somewhere. Yeah, look! A rainbow! Turn left, GB. <laughs> Jake, look! We must be in fairy tale land. It's beautiful. 
Beautiful. After tomorrow, I'll be the ruler of the richest kingdom in the land. But, Kimko, the princess still refuses to marry you. She'll change her mind when I get through with her. Are you going to put a spell on her with the scepter? I find such crude methods distasteful. No, I'll... What's that? Oh, I don't know, sire. Strangers. Strangers, eh? Well, take your ghost patrol and get rid of them. Yes, Kimko. I don't want anyone spoiling my plans now. There's the castle. Now, let's see. Madam said to find Prince Delwyn. Okay, look, Jake, we've got a welcoming committee. Yeah, uh, they don't look too friendly. Uh-oh, my nose is twitching. They're ghost knights. Should we bust them? Not yet. We're not looking for trouble. We're looking for Prince Delwyn. Tracy, get us out of here. Okay, okay. Faster, GB. They're gaining on us. Head for that cave. That's the last we'll see of them. I wonder why they gave up. Maybe they're afraid of the dark. Uh, I hate to say this, fellas, but I don't think we're alone. It's a monster! Get out of my cave! Uh, you bet! Hey, wait for me! Come on, guys, head for the outside. I'm coming, Jake. My feet can't go as fast as my head tells them to. Monster, he's just a little troll. Hey, you're not a ghost patrol. No, we're, we're Ghostbusters. And we're looking for Prince Delwyn. Really? Well, you're looking at him. What? You're the prince? Well, <laughs> you're a troll. Yeah. Gimgol put a spell on me and turned me into an ugly troll. He wants to marry the Princess Gwendolyn himself so he can rule the kingdom. And I guess there's nothing I can do about it. Oh, don't say that! Why don't you marry her anyway? <sighs> no, I can't. You see, she doesn't know I'm the prince. Well, maybe you should tell her. No, you don't understand. I can't. You see, after the spell was put on me, I hid outside in the bushes under Gwendolyn's window. And that night, I heard her crying. <gasps> What has Kim Gold done with you? It broke my heart seeing my dear Gwendolyn so upset, so I tried to comfort her. Please, don't cry, princess. What? Who's that? Your voice sounds familiar. Could it be my handsome prince? Please, come out where I can see you. Oh, an ugly troll! Go away, you horrible thing! She found me repulsive. That is why she must never know who I really am. I want her to remember me only as I once was, a handsome prince. Don't give up yet, Delwyn. There has to be a way to break the spell. I'm not so sure. Gimgol's magic is very strong. <sighs> but it's not me I'm worried about. I'm afraid for my dear Gwendolyn. I wish there was some way to free her. 
but she's guarded by Gimgul's ghost patrol. Well, maybe so, but we're the Ghostbusters. We'll help you free your princess. Will you? Thank you. But you must promise not to tell Gwendolyn I'm the prince. I still want her to remember me as a handsome young man, not as a hideous troll. Don't worry, Delwyn. You'll be a prince again. We promise. I still wish you'd let me fly you in. Thanks, GB, but you'd be spotted. This way we can sneak in. Ready, guys? Yo, I am. Then let's go, GB. Hang on. <laughs> Yes, but we must get over this wall. At any moment, we could be spotted. You already have been spotted. <clears throat> it's Kim Cool. Uh, hi. Sorry to drop in unannounced. Where are the Ghostbusters? Oh, the Ghostbusters. Well, too bad you can't hang around for my wedding. But you have somewhere else to go. Actually, we don't. Do we, Tracy? <clears throat> Oh, but you do. This little piggy went to market. Hey, wait, cut it out. This little piggy stayed home. Go! Home by us. Quick thinking, Tracy. Oh, thanks. That was a close call. Everyone all right? I'm okay, Ducky. Me too. But we still have to get into that castle. How are we gonna do that, Jake? There's the answer. The secret tunnel. I forgot about it. It leads inside the castle. Great, Delwyn. That's our way in. This is it. This bridge will take us right back into the castle. Come on, Gwendolyn needs us. He's right. Let's go, Ghostbusters! Buster! 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 Uh, I don't like the looks of this. Eddie, come on. Shaking a bridge! Hey, it's not me! Oh no! Behind you! Look! Hey, you two! Cut it out! <laughs> Cut it out? Just what we had in mind. Oh no! Look out! Oh! Ta-ta for now, ghost bunglers! You're getting tired of hanging around this place. Then let's get out of here, now! Uh, Ghostbusters, I'm afraid I've got some bad news. Oh, oh, no! Climb, guys! Keep... <laughs> Pull, Delwyn! Pull! We'll never find a way into the castle and rescue Gwendolyn. We're beaten. Hold on, Delwyn. My Grandpa Kong always says you're not beaten until you quit trying. And we're not about to quit. Right, guys? Yeah, that's right. Thanks, Ghostbusters. Princess. 
That's what you think. <laughs> now, Eddie is a ghost knight. Hmm. That gives me an idea. Now we all look like Gimgol's skeleton crew. I say this ghost busting business is jolly fun. <laughs> Tracy, where'd he go? He found a secret panel. What are you doing here? You're supposed to be with the princess. <coughs> what? Speak up! <coughs> Wait a minute. You're no ghost. <coughs> ah, let him go. Those ghost busters are too late. In a few minutes, I'll be married to the princess. And I shall be ruler of this land at last. Phew. Now I know what a sardine feels like. What's that music? Uh, it sounds like the wedding march. No. Dost thou, Princess Gwendolyn? Take the Gimgo. I... I... I can't hear you. I... I said... No! Oh, no, not again. You're too late, you troublesome troll. The princess is mine. Oh, go away, you horrible troll. If I marry Gimgo, my prince will be safe. She's doing that for me. She loves you. Tell her who you are. No, I can't. I'm too ugly. But I have to do something. Unhand her, Gimgul! Make me, if you can. <laughs> oh! Oh! Trolls, ghouls, and now apes! Oh, what a day! I have had enough of your meddling. Guards, get them. Don't bother, Gimgul. I'll deliver myself. <laughs> Tracy, look out! <laughs> Way to go, Trace! Yeah, nice work. Oh no, the troll needs help. My spell scepter will take care of you. You've missed. Not this time, troll. Enjoy your flight. As for the rest of you, zap them, Jake. Right. Oh, no! Oh, yes! And now... Oh! Mind if I drop in? Oh, you troublesome troll, I'll... Sorry, your history, Gimgool! Thanks, guys. My heroes, thanks to all of you, my kingdom is safe once again. We couldn't have done it without the troll. I know, and I owe him an apology. Friend Troll, I am ashamed. I was very mean to you, and yet you came to my rescue. Oh, please forgive me, my beautiful and brave Troll friend. Oh, I'm... I'm me again. Oh, Delwyn, it's you! You are the Troll! Yes, my darling, but now the spell has been broken by your kiss. Gee, Gwendolyn's kiss broke the spell just like in a real fairy tale. That's right, Eddie. And do you know what happens next in a fairy tale? Uh, yeah. They, they all live, live happily ever, ever after. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just love happy endings. Me too, madam. But the best part was when the princess kissed the troll, she didn't know it was her prince. Yeah, she liked him anyway. Well, that's important to remember. We should accept people for who they are, not what they look like. Right on. Let's go!
from me 4,000 years ago by the feral Acton. I want it back. How did you get it? How do you think? I stole it. Yeah, but boss, it's in the Middle East Museum. That's the most heavily guarded museum in the world. I know that. Don't you think I know that, too, that breath? But I found just the ghosts I need to break into the museum and get the diamond. <laughs> and who might that be? Oh, oh, Emperor of Evil. What? <laughs> Did you see that cat run? <laughs> Did you see that guy when Cavity gave him the old too scary glare? <laughs> Boy, was he frightened. <laughs> I think nothing of it. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I think it was me. Ever since you got that guitar, all you think about is making music instead of being scary. <laughs> right. Come on, we've got more spooking to do. I don't think I'm gonna like this. <laughs> Bone. They've gone away on a trip to Egypt to look for their mummies. Knock it off, Ansel Bone. Gotcha. <laughs> Ghostbusters here. You say some ghosts are up to some mischief? Okay, we'll see what we can do. Let's go, go! on the Ghostbusters. Prime Evil might hear about it. Yeah, all right, right. Well, you can count me out, Big Tooth. You guys are looking for trouble. Gee, Flossie, you're no fun anymore. Come on, we'll do it without her. Wait a minute. The old ghost sniffer is picking up some activity. And it's never been wrong yet. There! There! See them? Hey, 
I'll teach you to mess with my hubcaps. Guitar. It put us all to sleep. Hey, those ghosts are getting loose. No chance. They're going to ghost limbo. Wait. Now what? Don't send them to ghost limbo. They're really not bad ghosts. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I mean, really. I don't know. You guys have been scaring a lot of people. Hey, just joking around, honest. We didn't do anything really spooky. <laughs> it's true. Give us a chance. I promise we won't scare anybody else. Except maybe on Halloween. What do you guys think? Should we let them go? Sure. They're harmless. <clears throat> Two votes yes, one vote no. Okay, we'll give you a chance, but you'd better not blow it. Let him loose, Trace. Don't forget, any more trouble and we'll be back here in a flash. Yeah, they gone. <laughs> yeah, we shuffled the Ghostbusters. <laughs> Good work, Bossy. Good work? I meant what I said when I promised we wouldn't get into any more trouble. Oh, come on, Bossy. You're too scary, too. We ghosts don't have to tell the truth. Oh, yeah? Well, maybe it's time we change that. <laughs> What are we gonna do? I'll tell you what to do! <laughs> What's the matter, Trace? Uh, tooth scaries. The tooth scaries? You don't think they meant what they said about being good? Nope. Okay. Let's go back and see what they're up to. Okay, dokey. Big Tooth is right. Ghosts don't have to tell the truth. Glad you agree with me, Prime, old buddy. Don't call me Prime and never call me Buddy! Oh, no, sir. I got Mr. Uh, Prime, uh, uh, Mr. Evil. I mean, oh, <laughs> it sure got hot all of a sudden. Now, I have a job for you, Tooth Scaries. <laughs> First, we go to Haunt Quarters. <laughs> Wait a minute, guys. Don't forget. We promised the Ghostbusters. Ghost? Yeah, you 
Ghostbusters! That's right, Mr. Um, uh, uh, Evil. We promised we wouldn't get in trouble, so we can't go with you. You misunderstood. I didn't ask you to go to Haunt Quarters. I told you you were going. <laughs> He's got the scaries. They're gone. But what would he want with them? Good question. I wish I had a good answer. We've got to find out what they're up to. Or Madam Y. Madam Y. Maybe she can tell us. Good thinking, Trace. Let's go. <laughs> Your small and insignificant talents. Watch. The diamond of the Nile, the largest diamond in the world. I want it, but it's in the most heavily guarded museum in the world. How are you going to get him to get it? I'm not. You are. <laughs> <laughs> well, but you can count me out. I don't steal from anybody. Now, if you don't mind, I'd like to get back to the city. You'll get back when I tell you to. <laughs> Freezing. Please, Blasi, do what he says. Oh, no, uh, all right, I'll do what you want. But first, unfreeze Sweet Tooth. <laughs> that was a mouthful of icicles. Nah. Here's the plan. We'll begin by using your music. <laughs> Prime Evil must be planning to use the Tooth Scaries. Yeah, but for what? Hmm. I think I've got something. Wow! What a rock! It surely is something! What? I've never seen anything like it in my life. Uh, that's got to be the biggest diamond this side of Texas. The Diamond of the Nile. He wouldn't be foolish enough to try to steal that from the museum. Prime Evil's not foolish. He's smart. We better find out what he's up to. Yeah, okay, Flossy. This is our big chance. Get that magic guitar going. I don't like this. There's no choice. Prime Evil's watching us in his view screen. If we don't do what he says, he'll freeze us. Oh, all right. What's that music? Oh, it's so pretty. I think I'll just sit down and <sighs> listen. Been set off. Yeah, but look, the cards are asleep. They sure are sound asleep. Gee, how are we gonna get in? Sorry, we have to do it, but there's only one way. Go to it, Trace. Okay. <laughs> I hear the noise. So this is how you guys stay out of trouble, huh? 
a Ghostbuster. Uh oh, look out! I got it. Excellent. After four thousand years, the Diamond of the Nile is mine again. Hold on, Primeval. That diamond doesn't belong to you. It will in a minute. Now, hand it over. No chance, Prime. <laughs> that puny dematerializer won't affect me. Don't give it to him, Big Tooth. Stay out of it, Flossy. Give me the diamond, and you will have riches and power beyond your wildest dreams. Yeah, and you also know that you're nothing but a thief. Yeah, that's not true. I'm not a thief. I was just doing a, a, a favor for Primeval. Then don't give it to him. We're not bad. Not like Primeval. And you know it. She's right, Big Tooth. This is your second chance. Make the most of it. I don't know why I'm doing this, but okay. My diamond! <laughs> Pay for that? Yeah, uh, like, uh, put it on my credit card, man. <laughs> hey, what? <laughs> what happened? The reflected light from that diamond, it's blinding him. Stop it! Stop it! I can't see! You wanna play? All right, try this! <laughs> Uh oh, the beam hit the ceiling. Yeah, it's coming loose. No problem. Hand over that diamond on this museum is history. Quick, Jake, shine the light on him again. Right. Hey, cut it out. We gotta stop him before he wrecks the whole museum. Put the dematerializer on max power and aim it at the diamond. Max, we've never used that much power. There's no telling what will. No time to talk, Eddie. Do it. Okay, full power. What are you doing? The diamond is. It's working. Keep it at full power. It's too strong. I can't. You win for now, ghost busters. But I'll be back. Whew, that was close. Oh my gosh, I forgot about the ceiling. Tracy, are you all right? Oh, really, Funky Ducky? Mm, proud of it. Yeah, what did he say? He said he's proud of you, and we are too. You made the right choice this time. Yeah, we felt good when we were doing the right thing. <sighs> Besides, Fozzie's gonna be a big music star. We're gonna be her roadies. Aw, I'm not that good. Show sure you are, Foss. Show him. Just don't put them to sleep. <laughs> okay. Hi, gang. The Tooth Scaries had a hard decision to make in today's show, but I think they made the right choice. Boy, can you believe how those bad guys turned around and became good guys? Yes, I can, because I saw them do those good things. And people are the same way. Everyone can change for the better. You can, and you can, and you can.